Hello everyone, I am Hari, Hadoop Online Trainer from Great Online Training. In this video, I am going to explain the brief history of Hadoop. Before proceeding to watch this video, please go through my demo video on Big Data and Hadoop. I will explain the history of Hadoop as a simple story. These are the years where uh, a few milestones of Hadoop were there. Initially in 2002, two guys called Duck Cutting and Mike Caffarella started working on a project called Notch, which was their ambitious project by that time. What is Notch exactly? It is like a web search engine, like uh, our Yahoo or Google search engines. Generally what a web search engine will do, okay, when you search for something, it will search all the web pages it have and it will give few results. So what they need to have to develop this project? So they need to have a huge storage hardware and which and the data should be in the form of web pages and there should be indexes on these pages for the faster search. They found it very much expensive like half million dollar for the hardware cost and they need to spend $30,000 per month for the support. And also, they found that it won't be scale up to billions of pages. So they are having these problems. So meanwhile, in 2003, Google presented uh, a paper on Google file system, GFS, which was actually running in Google's production by that time. And these guys were inspired by that Google file system because it is giving the advantage of reducing the hardware costs and reducing the support calls and also it is taking care of indexing of the pages. That's why they have started their own distributed file system that is open source implementation of much distributed file system. And in 2004, again, Google presented one more paper on MapReduce, which is a faster processing framework. And these guys started working on implementation of MapReduce as well as it is very faster to process huge amounts of data. In the early 2005, they have working MapReduce implementation by mid of 2005 measure of the notch algorithms are transformed to use MapReduce. Yes, now the NDFS implementation and MapReduce implementation are done in notch and which is beyond the simple search what they required. And then they formed an independent sub-project of Nudge that is Lucene which was called Hadoop later. Then in 2006, Yahoo hired duck cutting and they gave a dedicated team and resources to turn Hadoop into a system that runs at web scale, that is large scale. And in 2008, Hadoop is the top level project at Apache and also Facebook launches a new application or a new framework Hive which is an SQL support for Hadoop. Actually the Hadoop was developed in Java and now they have provided SQL support for Hadoop and then Yahoo registers a world record of processing one terabyte of data in just 209 seconds that is 3.5 minutes approximately by using 910 nodes with Hadoop. So it is 
a break of world record which is previously 297 seconds to process 1 terabyte and then after few months Google break this record by processing 1 terabyte of data in just 68 seconds later Yahoo also break that record by processing the 1 terabyte of data in just 62 seconds over 400 nodes by using Hadoop so since then the trend of processing large amount of data in faster rates is started and in 2012 Hadoop 2.0 that is yarn got released and with this Hadoop became more popular with its new features than earlier and recently in 2016 Hadoop completed its 10 years and the celebrations are done and that's the brief history of Hadoop if you like this video please hit the like button and if you want to get more updates from great online training please subscribe to our youtube channel Thank you for watching.